Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So I'm filing a lawsuit against the federal government for uh, COVID-19 for lack of objective testing. The lack of objective testing uh, by the CDC, health departments, and other agencies who proceeded to uh, administer vaccinations and they used Dr. Al- Anthony Fasiri, Fasiri, or how you pronounce his name, to spread and continue to spread propaganda uh, in which the mainstream media had decided to censor and put censorship on anybody who uh, spoke out against vaccinations or had alternative media in an attempt to stifle free speech. Um, the stifling of free speech is was caused irreparable damage. I am also suing the President Joe Biden for moral turpitude, as well as Kamala Harris for moral turpitude, and who should not be in office uh, due to their behaviors in the first off in the 87 when Joe Biden ran for presidency, where he plagiarized speeches and he proceeded to falsify his own. Uh, educational background. Uh, Kamala Harris arrested the man for murder, and nor did he do it. He was later found innocent and released, uh, but he was found guilty without trial. Uh, This occurs common in California, and it's um, the second lawsuit that was filed is against multimedia giants such as Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, who are also censoring different things. Uh, I have had websites taken, web pages taken down uh, without notice. Um, there has been individuals who has also suffered this um, taken down without notice or given violations. Um, this occurred after I complained that it was protected information, uh, that it was protected under free speech, and uh, that these individuals can't not claim that it's false and cannot verify whether it's false because people have to think and apply that for themselves. Um, I was then banned the next day without notice. Um, this is a stifling of free speech. YouTube has also banned my page in which I had to open up multiple pages in order to actually be able to put my information out there. Um, Facebook, um, the Facebook and multimedia platform lawsuit also includes the corporate corporation's ability to collect information and the continued uh, violations of civil rights and privacies of individuals, uh, the Marilyn versus Smith case in which Zuckerberg and his lawyers have stated that, that they do not need to uh, uh, apply with the fourth uh, comply with the Fourth Amendment, that they can subvert it because a pin does not apply to the uh, Fourth Amendment and that they can actually go around it. This is concerning because that means media can turn over to whatever they want. And since media, uh, since phones and multimedia platforms and other platforms uh, that use pins uh, to commonly access their websites, all these platforms will be able to subvert constitution and give and turn over to uh, those individuals, uh, police agencies or other agencies or third parties that are requesting it without the consent of the individual. Um, and this is concerning. These are some of the basis for my lawsuit and I hope to actually make a difference in in getting some of these things done. Uh, some of the damages I am seeking is general damages, uh, monetary damages, uh, but the, the most important thing that I want to do is change. Uh, I'm doing it in a tort form so that I can actually change uh, the... Um, The main reason I'm doing this tort is so uh, that uh, we can change the ability of the um, 
corporations to spy. Um, we are very much concerned with corporate. Uh, we are very much concerned with with uh, government spying, but we are not as concerned with gov with corporate spying. And this is concerning to me because these information do turn information over to the government, third parties, foreign and domestic, and given the fact that these companies when you are removed and or you need to verify your identification you have to give very personal details such as a birth certificate identification card address some type of revealing information uh, this is very concerning because they already have your information why do they need more information to verify who you are um, this this is um this can cause issues of fraud and um this is very concerning to me as well um not just the form of government so uh regarding corporate spying um this is some of the basis for the lawsuit that is occurring in the northern district court and i hope that this will change things for the better for society Please understand that the this is not an attack on people who have died from COVID. I'm not discrediting that. I'm discrediting the fact that there was objective testing before this was done and that the polio, it's going to be like the polio vaccine. It's only going to get worse if we don't have objective testing before administration. Thank you.